The World Wildlife Day was today observed at the Kenya National Theatre in Nairobi with the theme sustaining all life on Earth, which includes all animal and plant species as well as the lives of people, those living closest to nature. According to Africa's Wildlife Campaign Manager of Wild Animal Protection, building a sustainable movement of people will care and advocate for better wildlife welfare. If you look at what is happening globally right now, coronavirus outbreak, if we don't stop wildlife trade, then I think we'll continue to face some of these challenges. Putting aside the welfare of ourselves from a health perspective, but also the animals themselves, I think it's at that point when countries, when the governments put a stop on wildlife exploitation that we will be able to confront and address those challenges. African Network for Animal Welfare also joined the world in marking the Wildlife Day with agenda of promoting humane treatment to all animals and well-being of communities living with them. Siku hii uh, ni kusherekea umuhimu wa nyamapori. Wanyamapori hufanya uh, uh, sisi uh, tuweze kuyahifadhi yale maeneo ambayo ni uh, natural ama yale maeneo ambayo tunayategemea sana 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 kwa uh, uzalishaji wa hewa safi ama uh, utoaji wa hewa safi utoaji wa maji na mambo mengine haya maeneo pia hutegemewa uh, kwa kutusaidia um, uh, ku, kuwa na wanyamapori uh, wengi zaidi ambao huwa ni kivutio kikubwa cha utalii lakini hawa wanyamapori wana changamoto zao na siku ya leo ni kujaribu kuhamasisha umati ya kwamba tujaribu uh, tuhifadhi wanyamapori wetu kwa sababu wana faida mingi na hizo faida hata sisi wenyewe tunafaa kuzishughulikia na kutafuta njia ya kufaidika nazo zaidi in his speech today, the UN Chief Antonio Guterres urged everyone to remember that they depend on Mother Earth to survive and is advocating for more caring, thoughtful, sustainable relationship with nature. Joel Chacha, Switch TV, Nairobi.